Now, Om Amen. Session and uh, you know, I'm 30 minutes, but I'm gonna cut it down to 10 minutes, really, because I, I think you heard it enough. And I'm gonna give you really, really what 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 we have been doing as a hierarchy, and we have a lot of great leaders from from different teams within PFAs here. Uh, you know, besides all this things happening, uh, you know, you you probably want to know how, right? What do we do within our hierarchy to grow in such a speed? Besides you know, tax free retirement book, uh, besides uh, you know uh, the weekly CEO mastermind conference call, uh, besides the training sales, there's a lot of small pieces of the puzzle that gotta be in place in order for things to happen. Okay, uh, but ultimately, to me, one thing that we all have to do is recruiting, and obviously recruiting into the right market. Is that right? So that's what you've been hearing so far, started from you know from the from day one, from day the senior leadership meeting all the way to now. So we all understand we have to recruit, yes? Yes. You don't have to be the best salesperson. You can recruit people that's good in selling under your organization. So I knew this. Uh, I think after Davis uh, put a meet, uh, put a fino, uh, trip, uh, we gotta get our whole hierarchy into the recruiting mode, into the right market. So we have launched a plan of focus. It's a specific design plan that get our leaders to focusing on recruiting. So I'm gonna share with everybody, regardless you in my hierarchy from the West Coast, you haven't know about it yet, or the East Coast, you guys already know about it, you're doing it very well, or from Georgia, Atlanta, from Texas, this is the plan that we're running. And it's working. Now I'm telling you what this plan is. If you follow this plan religiously, and get your people to follow this plan, I guarantee you, you are not gonna fail. Okay, so I want to show you, I'm kept to the chase, I'm gonna show you what this plan is. Now, how do we enlarge it a little bit? Is there any way we enlarge it? Can you guys see it? Yeah. Okay, all right. We, we have launched the Conquer Your Future shirt plan within our organization. I knew in order for you to have solid leaders popping out of the hierarchy, you gotta have numbers. Just like water, it boils at what degree? Anybody know? 212 degrees. What if when the water start to boil at 212 degrees, you turn it off at 210? It doesn't boil anymore. So people ask me, how many recruits do you have to recruit a month in order for me to see quantum growth and money coming in? I, I have studied for my last 16 years for my practice company. All along to right now, I know the numbers. I study the numbers. Let me tell you something. The key is you gotta hit 10 base shopping routes. 10. What is 10? Not personal. I don't care if you recruit one person that recruit, one person recruit another nine. That's 10 a month. It has to be in a calendar month. I don't care if you recruit three to rec, another three, that's 10. You can recruit 10 by yourself, that's 10. So does it make sense? If you want to make the money these guys are making up here, at least 10 grand, 15 grand consistently every month, your base shop has, has to have 10 base shop recruits on a monthly basis. So in our hierarchy, when any individual, doesn't have to be director, you could be at 30% level, you hit 10 base shop recruit in a month, in our hierarchy, we award you the white, Conquer your future shirt, shirt uh, to recognize that you hit your 10 base shop recruits. If you have 10 base shop recruits, how many training sales do you have? Anybody can guess? 30? Some say 60? The answer is wrong. Infinity. Because if I have 10 recruits, they give me 6 sales. You think it's 6? You think it's 3? No. Because those 10 will recruit not 10. So 10 means what? Infinity. So in the hierarchy right now, for those of you who haven't, I see some of you have the white shirt. How many of you, since we launched the company future shirt plan in the hierarchy, the seal team plan, how many of you have the 10 base shop recruit? And even if you don't have the shirts, can you guys stand up real quick? All right? If you do have, take your shirts off, uh, take your jacket off, if you don't mind. Hey, give yourself a big hand. If you get not, if you get in the right market, there's a lot of sales. They have to take you out on training sales. So, how do I do it? You just do it. 
Well, well, how? Would you just do it? Just talk to people. At the end of the day, if you look in the mirror, you talk to yourself. You are alone, you know whether you're a winner or not by yourself. Look in the mirror, talk to yourself. Now, you want to get to 10, and then obviously the next month you try to get to the light blue shirt, which is 25 base shop. Now that's where the 100, 150,000, 200,000 dollars a year comes in. If you have 25 base shop recruits in your month, in a month, in, in any given month time, and you maintain that number, I promise you, you make up 150, 200,000 dollars a year. Absolutely, no question about it, because the numbers is there. I study those numbers. I copy those numbers. This is not my plan. This is. This, this is something that auto companies are doing, and they, they, they roll out on units because of this plan. How many of you currently have the 25 base shop recruits in a month? You have the light blue shirt with you. I know some of you have a higher shirt than that. You have the light, you qualify this month or so forth. You have the light blue shirt. Winner, see if you uh, show a winner this month. Oh, she got over 25 this month. Let's go, John. Good job.